This guy, he could use some pants. All right. The lady. <laughs> now we have to deal with that archer, though. Oh, he's going after Jacob. No. My beautiful butler. Hey guys, it's Adam AK Swimming Bird, and welcome to Fire Emblem Fates. If this is your first episode, please check out part one where we created our character and started the story. There's a link down in the description for you. Now, last time, our hero faced off against prisoners from the rival kingdom of Hoshido to prove herself in combat, and because we decided not to execute them, our daddy here, old gruff Hi. King Garen, is none too pleased with us, so hopefully we can patch things up. All right, Brunhilda, let's go in there together. I'll help as much as possible. This is our father we're talking about. He has to forgive you, right? I don't know. He kind of scares me. Thanks, Elise. I hope you're right. Let's do this. All right, deep breath, and here we go. She's a little too positive for this dreary kingdom. Father, we have something we need to talk to you about. Ooh. Okay. Daddy's done lost the piggy bank upstairs. ha <laughs> ha Father? It sounds like he's with someone. Maybe we should come back later. Looking for a new mom. Mm? Who's there? Sorry. Uh, oh, sorry to bother you, father. Yes, we apologize if this isn't a good time. What do you two want? I'm watching my stories. Well... Uh, father, we're here to apologize. Uh, right, Brunhilda? Yes. Yes, that's right. I'm sorry for questioning you. You may enter, but... Don't distract me. I'm in the middle of something weird and creepy. <laughs> we might not find out here. Or is... Nope, there's no one else in here. Okay, he's just talking to himself. When you're king, you can do that stuff. All right. Brunilda, you disobeyed a direct order from me. Ordinarily, you would not still be alive. Uh, I understand. Oh, no. no, father, I can explain. Mm, silence, my cutest child. As you are my child, Brunilda, I will grant you some leeway. I have something in mind for you, a mission. If you complete this task... So, sorry, I got distracted by the creepy thing on the ceiling. If you complete this task successfully, I will pardon your crime in full. <laughs> really? <laughs> what sort of mission? And what sort of noise was that? Listen well. There is an abandoned fortress perched on the Hoshiden border. I wish to know if the building there remains serviceable. You are to travel to the site and inspect the premises. No battle will be required. Well, I know how this goes. Most RPGs, they tell you you're not going to fight, but there's going to be enemies there. You've got to have some gameplay. Do you understand? I won't tolerate being disappointed twice. Yes. Yes, Father, it shall be done. Okay. Well, we can redeem ourselves in the eyes of that old gorilla. Let's do it. We got a special weird evil sword that we can put to use. And, uh, oh. What's going on here? He disappeared. Is he hiding? Okay, never mind. He's just gone. He went to bed or something. <laughs> this could be trouble. Darling, are you sure you're going to be okay out there? I don't like this. <laughs> of course. Please don't worry. It's just an abandoned fort. You're acting ra rather casual about all this, Brunhilda. It's isn't like father to be so forgiving. Huh? Huh? What do you mean, Leo? <laughs> That's enough, Leo. Don't be so worried all the time. Sheesh. I'm gonna puff my cheeks out all on a main cute and don't even try to scare Brunhilda before her first mission. <laughs> Smack! Jeez. She's got a she's got an arm on her, that one. Hey, that's not necessary. I suppose I'll just have to come along. That way I knew Brunhilda will be safe. I'm afraid that's not possible. Ooh, this guy, he's creepy looking. With a name like Iago, you know he's gotta be a trusted advisor. He's needs to wash his hair, it looks like, though. It's kind of stringy all in his face. <gasps> Why ever not, Iago? Let me explain. Lady Camilla, King Garen intends this expedition as a test of sorts. As his top advisor, and the only one with a weird sun halo, I have been entrusted with coordinating this mission. Uh, he would like to see, or to know, rather, whether Princess Brunhilda is worthy. After all, she is a part of the royal lineage. Therefore, your assistance would simply muddy the results. Understood. Understood. Camilla, I need to do this all by myself. Surely you understand. Hmm. Not all by yourself, Brunhilda. I'm here. I'm hiding behind the throne. Father? There he is. Father, didn't see you there. <laughs> He's a master of stealth with that clanky armor. Hmm. Rest assured, I don't intend to send you out there completely defenseless. Who do we got? This guy, he could use some pants. All right. 
Milady? <laughs> Hans, he's so formal and nice. Mm. This is Hans. He's a veteran warrior and drinking buddy of your dad. It will ensure no trouble befalls you. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Hmm, I don't like the cut of his jib. He doesn't have a headband like I do. Oh, he's gonna whisper something. <sighs> I'd be wary of that man if I were you, Brunhilda. Huh? Why do you say that? Hmm. He's a criminal, a murderer, and scoundrel. I arrested him myself years ago. Father seems to think he's rehabilitated, but I'm not so sure. And that said, he is a formidable soldier. I see. Doesn't look like someone I'd want watching my back. I want to keep him ahead of me where I can see where his weapons are. <laughs> okay, we're going to the bottomless canyon, the north side. This is the nicer side. Okay. And we're in the battlefield, so we know we're going to fight. Wow, is this it? The bottomless canyon? Here's our trusted caretaker here, Gunta. Yes, it's the national boundary dividing Norn Hoshido. Um. It can't really be bottomless, can it? Of course. Let the eternal darkness below be your answer. Those who fall in never return. I truly despise this place. Something about the land around here just isn't right. The sky here is always dark and foreboding, and lightning strikes all who fly across. So let's stand out on this bridge with our metal weapons held high. This is clearly a place us mortals were never meant to enter. Normally we'd go around, but the fort that King Garen wants to evade is right over there. I see. Oh, it's not so bad. Or perhaps I'm just happy to be outside in the fresh air. Uh, compared to the inside of that fortress, this is downright exciting. My, my. <laughs> my. Ah, oh, that certainly puts things in perspective, my lady. Come, let's proceed. So Gunter seems like he's tough. He's got a horse. I was trust of, you know, a good knight on your side. Blast! It looks like this force is, fort isn't as abandoned as we thought. It's got a force. Why the devil is this place crawling with Hoshidans? They're everywhere. Popping up like daisies. Hold on. Do not advance any farther, soldiers of Nor. Crossing that bridge is a violation of our border treaty. And I've got a ninja headband to prove it. Turn back at once or we'll be forced to attack. Ooh. What should we do, Lady Brunhilda? I'm Jacob, and I'm your very fancy butler, man. Uh, we're not here to fight, and I suppose we'll have to turn back and report to Father. Of course. Wise decision, milady. <laughs> Who asked you, old man? I'm here to fight. I'm claiming what? pants. <laughs> what? Uh-oh, Hans. You're a loose cannon, Hans. Yeah! Jeez. Ah! Oh, he did that for me, thanks. He's gone, okay. Ha <laughs> ha die scumbags. You'll pay for this. Uh-oh. <laughs> There's that sound again. Hans, what are you doing? We had no reason to engage these troops. Psh, I don't care. Why? I'm pantsless on a bridge. I can do whatever I want. We should have tried diplomacy first. We weren't sent here to fight. <laughs> Speak for yourself, weakling. What was that? What's that supposed to mean? Ooh. Oh. Soldiers of Hoshido, hear me. Do not leave a single Norian alive. Charge! Prepare to attack. All right. Ugh, looks like there's no getting out of this one. Get ready to fight, Lady Brunhilda. Okay, man. All right, with a quick drink of water, I am ready to go. I apologize for the little gap there since the last episode. I've been sick recently, and all these voices are taking a bit of a toll, especially Hans. Now then, Lady Brunhilda, there are two kinds of battle formations. I'm going to school you here. Now listen, you'll need to learn both and fast. You can take a defensive position by moving to the same space as an ally. Your ally will benefit from your support, you will, but you won't be able to attack. If you want to unleash the most potent attacks, stand in adjacent positions. From that alignment, allies may be able to attack simultaneously. I tell you more, but you're about to receive some badge gold experience. So this is the, uh, the big difference here in combat. One of the differences from Awakening, the last game, you don't always want to pair up. It seemed like in Awakening, pairing up was a pretty good strategy most of the time. You strengthen your bond, and you can help each other. But now, if you stand near each other, you'll get attack benefits. But if you pair up, you get a defensive benefit for a weaker unit. And we now have a thing called Dual Guard, which I'll show you when we get a chance. But right now, I'm going to... Yeah, there we go. He's so strong that we don't even need to worry. Jeez. I won't die here. That horse is built like a truck, and trucks haven't even been invented yet. Can he take the other one down? Let's find out. Yeah, he's doing zero damage, you can see on the bottom screen there. So you can see their chance to attack. He's got 84%, and we have 100. Didn't even need Brunhilda. Got him. Man, Gunther is laughing at his dead enemies. He's a little crazy. Hans is just rushing in. 
I'm afraid the enemy's position across that bridge may be impenetrable. We've got to look for another way across. Lady Brunhilda, see if you can find a dragon vein around here. They're just lying around all over the place. Precious dragon veins. So we've got a couple here. Ooh, yep, we can create a stone bridge. That would put us between those forces, which doesn't seem good. We want to just kind of head for this building if we are going to get there. And there's another little fort down there. I'm going to go for this dragon vein. So yeah, if you are paired up, the person who's not leading the fight cannot attack. But you will get that defensive benefit. And there's a dual guard feature now. You'll build up these little shield icons when you're paired up together. And maybe I should pair these two. I, I kind of want to keep everybody separate so I can heal with our butler and attack with the others. Hans is going to try his luck. But but yeah, the dual guard feature can save you from attacks. Yeah, die! I'm going to see if his axe will work. This is not smart, buddy. Look out! And double strike. Hans, we barely knew ye. He's gone. <laughs> Looks like I've done enough damage for the time being. Time to lay low and see how this all plays out. All right, so he's gone. He's not dead. He just faded away into the darkness. And now I won't have to voice him for a bit, hopefully. Okay, so I'm going to use this dragon vein here. We did this a little bit earlier. But yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to keep people separate. Unless they seem to be really hurting. Gods, did you see what just happened to the cliff? Who are we dealing with here? All right, and I'm going to put Gunter in a little bit of a position to, uh, to defend there. And let's... Let's keep these two close by. I don't know if they're going to move in. Oh, I'll, I'll keep him next to her, just because if you're in diagonal, you won't support each other. But if you're right next to each other, you will. I think Gunter will be okay against these guys. One of them's got a bow, and he can attack from farther away. I've got to be a little careful. Ooh, they're nimble. They do seem like it, though, so it makes sense. He's protected by his buddy a little bit. He's got a buffer, at least. And he's got that arrow. Ooh, we're going to have to be careful here. All right, I'll let Gunter do the attacking, and I'm going to bring in my buddy Jacob here, do some healing. There we go. Almost full health, so that's good. I think I'm going to move Brunhilda next to Jacob, or next to Gunter, and then she'll support him. There we go. Jacob's already leveled up. This will do. My lady needs me to be yet stronger. He's a better butler than before. All right, and I'll move here. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to attack with Lady Brunhilda. I'm going to keep her there, but she will help out. There we go. I don't want to put Brunhilda in harm's way too much. She's just starting out. Here we go. And if one attack doesn't work, there we go. All right, nice follow-up. The archer ran away like a coward, and we leveled up as well. So that's the benefits of having people next to each other yeah. instead of one. Man, that's a lot of stats. I must become stronger, even stronger. I must. <laughs> All right, now we have to deal with that archer, though. Oh, he's going after Jacob. No, my beautiful butler. No. Oh, okay, good. He's lead. He can dodge that. Man, that was only a 24% chance to miss, but Jacob's pretty nimble, so he should be good. All right, and then uh, I might... Hmm. I'm going to actually use Jacob to do this, since I don't think we need to heal. And he can attack from farther away. He's got those iron daggers. He's not going to do too much, but it's enough. There we go. Well, that's a good amount. I was going to say, so because that enemy had a bow and Jacob had a dagger, the daggers are good against swords and tomes, but not as good against axes and bows. Okay, how about we move my buddy in here? And uh, actually, I might, I'm going to move Brunhilda right here, let her kind of wait, and then we'll do another one of those dual attacks on this guy. He seems pretty strong, but we got... Our buddies working together. Do you even realize what you've done here today? Oshido won't stand for unprovoked attacks like this. Revenge will be ours. My horse just shook its little bottom there. Or Gunther's horse. <laughs> yeah, there he goes again. Right in the middle of that guy's impassioned speech. All right. And we can hold down the A button to speed this up a little bit. If you don't want to watch the full attack animation. That guy's got two hits, but he can't get my horse. It's quick. All right. Now it's long. As we're okay here, yeah. He'll do 10 damage if he hits both. He did. But guess what? We got somebody here where... Ooh, uh-oh. This ain't good. <laughs> got that archer. We should hopefully be okay. Now, Gunter's in a little bit of trouble. I don't want him to... Have trouble. <gasps> Ooh, we've got trouble for everybody. Look, more troops are arriving from the south. Be uh, more enemy and reinforcements. Take caution, Lady Boonhilda. 
Oh, we need to finish this quick. I'm actually going to heal Lady Brunhilda with my staff. And she should be okay. If we, uh, hmm. Thinking about pairing these two up, because Gunter is vulnerable. So he's got 7 HP left. I think we can do this. I'm going to attack with Brunhilda and then try to quickly capture that castle. This should be, as long as he doesn't dodge, should be okay here. Come on, Gunter. All right. And that archer is going to flee. <laughs> there he goes. I love when them, they run away. Oh, damn you! This isn't over! All right. Rated T for team, guys. Remember? And then, can Brunhilda get in there and capture this? We seized it! There we go, and finish the battle. Okay, none too soon, those Pegasus Knights were on our trail there. All right, so we did it. That's the end of our first for real battle. It wasn't kind of a training exercise or a test. Oh, uh, this was a test, I guess. <laughs> this wasn't what I had in mind, but at least I've completed Father's mission. This lightning barren land. You're the, uh, he needs a good, like, he looks pretty extreme there, Saizo. Maybe like a gravelly kind of ninja-y voice. You're the leader of these troops. Huh, you're a little girl. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> My name is Saizo. There we go, you can hear his real voice. My name is Saizo. I've come to claim your life. <sighs> hey, everyone, we're still under attack. This guy's come to claim my life. Die. Destroy them! Uh-oh, uh-oh. I won't allow it! <gasps> Somebody's here. Somebody's here to save us. <gasps> it's Xander! <gasps> Our buddy, our bro, big bro. Uh, what? This must be the real commander. Just in the nick of time. What is going on here, Brunhilda? <gasps> Xander, how did you know we were in trouble? We got, yep, everybody, the whole bunch came. You got Aha. the devil's own luck. We've arrived just in time. Your luck never runs out, does it, sister? You all right, dear? Are you all right? I was so worried about you. <gasps> we're all here for you, Brunhilda. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Um. But before we get too carried away, we are under attack. Uh -oh. Who dares attack my beloved Brunhilda? I'll have their heads on a platter. Oh. I'm not hurt, Camilla. A little bit. Not to worry. <laughs> but darling, it's the thought that counts. Uh-oh, she's got a dragon. Jeez. Okay. How can she attack twice in one turn? A little bit of a dramatic liberty there. I never knew Camilla could be so ruthless. Hehe, <laughs> that's right, she murders people. You've never seen her on the battlefield before. She's got a sweet dragon, though. She's a wyvern rider. This is not going well. <laughs> uh, Saizo. Is he gonna attack? Saizo, what's wrong? What's our status? I misjudged the situation. We're outnumbered. Kikaro, do you have any uh, else on the way? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe some reinforcements? Affirmative, Lady... Or, sorry, Lord Ryoma is right behind me. Please don't put me to death for confusing the gender of our our prince. Ah, then I think this battle is as good as won. Are they gonna flee? Are they gonna fight, I guess? It looks like more Hoshiden reinforcements on the way. I see. Indeed, what should we do? Well, well Brunhilda is safe and the vault's condition has been evaluated. There's no reason to engage Hoshido further at this point. Brunhilda, you take the lead with Gunther. We'll follow close behind. Understood. Will do, thank you, Xander. So we're fleeing out of here. We're not ready for this jelly yet. Okay, but we did beat the chapter, which uh, isn't always a sure thing in these games. They can be very tough, especially early on when your units are weak. Oh. Ooh, something's going on here, or else we wouldn't stop. Gunter, have you seen Jacob? He was here a second ago. <laughs> I'm sure he's right behind us. Uh, now hurry up. I can't stand being on this bridge a moment longer. My horse hates it. Uh-oh. Don't worry. You don't. won't have to stand there much longer. Okay. Don't worry. You, have to, you don't have to stand there much longer. <sighs> He said it for me. Hans! What? What is the meaning of this? <laughs> Let's talk more death. Uh-oh. Hey, get out of here. Gunter could have... No, Gunter! <laughs> Jeez. It's brutal. You didn't have to do his horse like that, too. Hans, no! Man, I thought Gunter could have taken Hans. He was destroyed earlier. Uh, why are you doing this? Your own ally. <laughs> ah, did I knock your babysitter into the ditch? Here, you can meet up with him at the bottom. Okay. I really don't trust Dad anymore. Whoa! He did give me these sweet gams, though. Dragon Lance Arm Activate! You'll pay for this! What? What kind of freak are you? One that can stab you with a crazy... Whoa! I got horns. I got a dragon fang arm. It can't be! I want answers, Hans. Why are you doing this? Why did you provoke the Hoshidans? 
And why did you kill Gunter? My favorite horse babysitter. <laughs> Answer me. I was just... Just following orders, King Garen's orders. <laughs> what? You lie. Yeah, I don't trust Dad anymore, for sure. <laughs> Come back here. Uh-oh. Oh, maybe we shouldn't be trusting Dad's evil sword. Okay. <laughs> huh? No! The sword is like, I want to go take a dive. Oh, somebody's after us. A glowing magical thing is going to help us maybe here. Or else our main character is out of the fight already. Okay, the sword's just going to take us down this pit. Who's, who will help us? Or maybe we're going after Gunter. Hey, it's... I forgot her name already, but she was in the first episode. It's Lilith! <gasps> my god! Or, my kin! My gods! My blood! Dragons, grant me strength! <laughs> Great Moro, I beseech you! Oh, what is she doing? Okay. Oh! Oh, she's adorable! She's a little dragon thing. Okay. But she, <laughs> she still had her tiny little bonnet on with the bow. She's so cute. And she saved us. Okay. <sighs> She's pretty strong. <laughs> Lilith, is that you? What are you? Should ask us the same thing. We turned into a weird thing, too. Oh, look at her. <laughs> She's like a weird catfish. But like a, you know, a land cat plus a fish. Lady Brunhilda, I, I knew this day would come eventually. Uh, this may come as a shock, but I'm not a human. <laughs> yeah, you think? No. <laughs> well, I could see that. Are you a dragon? Yes, this is my true form. You've seen it before, do you remember? That strange bird you rescued in the barn. Well, they talked about that earlier. Uh, that was you? It was. Once I recovered, I was able to take human form. You were so kind to me that I decided to remain a human that I might serve you. But now I have used a power that goes beyond the capability, or capacity, sorry, of a human body. I will not be able to return to that form. Uh, don't mind, though. The most important thing to me is that you're safe. Well. Most important thing to me is to give you a hug, because you're cute. Oh, eek! <laughs> Lilith, be careful! Drop me if you must. I won't have you sacrifice yourself for me! First dragons I call on you, grant us access to the astral plane! Man, this is getting heavy and crazy real fast here. I don't know where we're going. Well, I guess we're going to the astral plane. Let's see. I wanted to save Gunter. We've all we've forgotten about him, I guess. Uh, what just happened? We're in the windows background. Oh, whoa, this is beautiful. Well, Japan land. Uh, where are we? This is the world parallel to the one in which you live, Lady Brunhilda. Oh, I think this is going to be our castle, the My Castle system. It is known as the Astral Plane. Huh? How were you able to get us here? The first dragons have granted us the power to inhabit this dimension. Under their protection, we are safe here. Oh, allow me to prepare a place for you to rest. Dude, has got everything going on here. Cherry trees just constantly blo whoa <laughs> blooming. We got tree houses popping out of the ground. Did did you just use a dragon vein? Yes, the power of the first dragons flows freely in this realm. Plus, she's a dragon. Uh, you should know that space and time operate differently here as well. I see. I have so much to learn. Is there anyone else here? No, we are alone. Time for a dragon smooch. Uh, there's no one left here. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to invoke any bad memories. It's okay, Brunhilda. I'm not lonely as long as I have you in my life and my precious floaty pearl. Uh, now we sh you should get some rest. Okay, let's jump in that treehouse and take a snooze, I guess. Recover from that battle. Try to wrap our heads around just what the heck is going on in this game. But we'll learn. I'm intrigued. I want to see what's going to happen here. I feel like Gunther's not dead. He fell into a bottomless pit. Uh, how are you feeling, Brunhilda? Brunhilda? I know there's a lot to take in. Thank you. Yes, it is. But I feel much better now. My wounds seem to have healed already. And my mind is racing. I have so many new questions about this world. All in good time. For now, some business remains in the other world. Yeah. Your your family kind of abandoned them to die. Yeah, yes, you're right. I can't relax until I know everyone made it safely home. Especially my butler. Of course, there is just one thing you should know before you go back. When I open the portal, you will return to the same location you came from. That means you'll arrive right on the Hoshiden border. There may be soldiers lying in wait for you. Understood. I understand. I'll be ready for them. Very well, then I'll open the gate. I've got my crazy dragon powers, apparently, that we know of from Smash Brothers. <laughs> so we're going to do our best. All right. Popping back in. I missed that little beautiful land already. Going back to this lightning canyon. Okay. <sighs> we're good. Everyone's gone now. Ah, I'm back. But where is everyone? 
You're mine, Norian. Hmm? <laughs> Immediately attacked. Oh, jeez. Okay. I think I know who that was. I could get a little glimpse there. They look... Oh, no. I, I know who it is now. <laughs> I was going to say, they looked familiar. All right, that's it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Next time, we're heading on to Chapter 4, and I'll see you then. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. We'll have more Fire Emblems soon. Goodbye.